overall do you recommend people to come to Vietnam? Next time I won't do the whole country. Some Vietnamese really don't. Other than that, I think Vietnam is a perfect country to be in. Welcome to another episode of Tag Along with Chai. I am leaving Vietnam. I've been here for several weeks and I tell you about my experiences at the end of this episode. But more interesting, I am not the only one who's leaving. No, let's try to find some interesting foreign tourists that have been here for quite some time to see what their experiences are. I came over holiday, Re yeah. really enjoyed it. Yeah, it was great. Was yeah. this your first time or? Yeah, first time, yeah. Oh. yeah. How long have you been? Um, about 12 days now. And I was on a tour, yeah. and started in Hanoi. Then went out to the Mekong Delta, yeah. and uh, really enjoyed it. So yeah. In these 12 days, what was the highlight? Highlights was the boat trip, so I did a couple of boat trips. Halong Bay yeah. and uh, the Mekong Delta would have been the yeah, absolute okay. yeah. highlights, but um, I quite enjoyed the whole lot of it actually. Yeah. The food was terrific. So are you, because uh, this was your first time, are you coming back you think? I think so, yeah. Yeah, yeah next time I won't do the whole country, oh, yeah. uh, I might come say do the south and then spend more time in the Mekong Delta. Yeah, okay. Um, perhaps the time after that I'll go to Hanoi and do all the north. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I'll leave the middle alone, it's a bit too hot there for me. Yeah. Da Nang, I'd probably uh, explore Da Nang yeah. a bit more. We yeah. um, didn't spend much time there. Are you going back to Australia? Yeah, now today, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I'm going to Singapore and then through to Perth. I'm flying into Perth but I live in the country, I'm a farmer. Uh, okay. And the wheat, wheat belt, so yeah, 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 yeah. I've got a lot, a lot of travelling to do. Ah, uh, so, so you, uh, do you own a farm, you're saying? So yeah, 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 uh, yeah. Is that why you only come here for 12 days? Yeah, 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 yeah. it's the freest time of the year, but it's always busy on a farm. Is there something that maybe was not so pleasant on your trip or something that we should look out for? Um, got to be careful of the traffic, very careful, like, um, when you walk across the crosswalk, it yeah. doesn't mean much. You just still got to be alert yeah. for the traffic. Most of the streets are very clean, but odd streets are a bit dirty and a bit too much rubbish for, for my liking. But uh, the main main issue would be the traffic. Green light doesn't really mean a lot. It doesn't mean a green light. No, no, no. No, it's still motorbox yeah. tearing around. The motorbox, the cars are good, but the motorbox are the worst. Yeah, yeah, they're yeah. just everywhere. Yeah, yeah. Um, so that would be the worst bit. Oh, then the food's too good. You eat too much. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you been in Vietnam? A week. We arrive in Hanoi, Along Bay. We take the train to Hue and uh, and then uh, again the train to yeah. uh, Ho City. Very busy schedule. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's, what's your highlight? The Imperial City in Hanoi was yeah. really really beautiful. You're flying now to Bali, how long yeah. are you gonna stay in Indonesia? 10 days. The whole trip all together? Five weeks. Um, we, we go to Thailand and Laos yeah. before. What's the best story you have so far? We saw the water puppet show uh, in Hanoi and uh, okay. it was uh, really cool. Do you like the food here? Yeah, yeah, the food is cool. How about the people? Yeah, the people, the people are, are great. Yeah, yeah? really. Yeah, okay. yeah. Is there something that you didn't like here in Vietnam? The traffic <laughs> is horrible. <Okay. laughs> we almost died a few times. <laughs> yeah, um, but yeah. Mm -hmm. If that's all. Yeah. yeah, it's a little noisy with the, all the yeah, all, all the traffic is noisy. Yeah, yeah but also. but yeah, it was. It was amazing. So overall, do you recommend people to come to Vietnam? Absolutely. It yeah. was uh, so far. It was our best uh, country uh, of uh, Thailand and Laos. Oh. It's, it's uh, here that we prefer. So uh, yeah. yeah, perfect. Uh, do you have a message to the world or some wisdom to pass on? Ooh, peace, <laughs> please, <Yeah>. peace. <laughs> I've been staying here for five years. I'm a teacher here. Okay. I'm what do you English, teach? I mean, I'm an English teacher. Yeah. So, uh, but as of the moment, I'm taking my leave. I'm I'm going to go to a place where I'm going to unwind and oh. relax. So you are a lot of people coming to Vietnam to go on holiday, but you are escaping Vietnam for a holiday. Let's say uh, I'm enjoying so much in Vietnam. Yeah. So we have a few days. Uh, next week, okay. uh, holidays in yeah. Vietnam, that would be four to five days. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to room around the country. Where are you going now? I'm going to Taiwan. To Taipei, I can imagine. And yeah, what you done? What you gonna do there? Uh, I just want to see uh, what Taipei looks like. Back to Vietnam, it's five years already. Why do you choose to live here and not in the Philippines or anywhere else in the world? They're looking for teachers here. Okay. And it would be great to share our knowledge. Yeah, to yeah. kids and to those who are willing to learn English yeah. also. Is it easy for you to work anywhere else in Southeast Asia or is it just Vietnam that is really easy for you? As long as we have this TESOL certificate. Okay. So I guess it's not uh, very difficult. What's the best thing in Vietnam? Uh, f first of all, the best thing in Vietnam is the food. <laughs> so at first, you will not really appreciate 
because because you think that it tastes not good but if yeah. you try to to really try it yeah and that's the the awesomeness of the food and then you will understand the culture is there something that you don't like about vietnam yeah everywhere there's something not good yeah, and yeah, yeah. there are good as well so maybe like uh like some kind of personality like uh, some some vietnamese really don't uh, care so much of putting some garbages where should this stuff should be placed mm -hmm. so everywhere you can see some garbage beans yeah. but they just ignored it they they chose to throw yeah. it somewhere yeah. because maybe they think that the government is paying for Cleaner. the cleaners yeah, yeah. so it, it's so sad but i guess uh people will will think about it yeah. in the future yeah i think um, i've been here about 12 years ago and the improvement already it's been uh, incredible the it's a lot of changes here the beaches are a lot cleaner yeah what's your favorite place in vietnam uh so far danang yeah danang is uh, for me yeah. it's a perfect place to visit it's so clean the people are so warm the temperature everything's good in danang so if you come to Vietnam, you're gonna have to book a few days in Da Nang at least, right? Yeah, Da Nang, Da Nang. You have you have to visit Da Nang. <laughs> life is so short, so enjoy your life every day. Okay, travel as long as you can travel. I think that was interesting enough, but let me just share you quickly my experiences. Some people are very direct and efficient with their answer, the way they communicate. If you're ordering, standing in line, ordering something, they're just like pam 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 can be quite cold, but overall the Vietnamese people have been super friendly. There's a lot of new development and the amount of cafes throughout the country, I think tripled. There are really cool, fancy urban areas in all the bigger cities. And if you're interested in a country which is safe, but very different than other countries in the world, I think Vietnam is also one of your countries. The worst thing about Vietnam or the thing that I don't like about Vietnam, um, it's hard to say, but I think the rubbish in Halong Bay it was definitely something I was not expecting, the amount of rubbish that was floating in the water, especially because it's a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Hopefully they're able to do something about this. Other than that, I think Vietnam is a perfect country to be in, uh, traveling or living. We met a lot of interesting people along the way and I hope you enjoyed this series, the Vietnam series. This channel is based in Thailand, showing you the beauty of Southeast Asia. And now we are leaving back to Thailand again. Goodbye, Vietnam. Thank you for hosting us and I hope to see you again. Thank you so much for watching till the very end. I would like to say from the international airport of Ho Chi Minh City, bye for now and stay champ.